This is Dr. Corey Moss on Looking Your Best. I'm excited to talk about a product that has been newly approved by the Food and Drug Administration, the FDA. It's a, in the family of Restylin, uh, made by a, a company, Galderma. And Restylin, many of you know about. There's Restylin L with lidocaine, and of course in that family is Perlane, a slightly larger particle size. And then the newest product is called Restylane Silk. And Restylane Silk worldwide has been around for over a decade and it's called Restylane Fine Lines in Europe and uh, in Canada. In the US it's going to be called Restylane Silk. And it's been specifically designed as a very small particle size, if you will. Think of these things as gels. I've talked about this before. And the very tiny particle size of gel makes it flow very smoothly and makes it a really good in, uh, product for indications like the fi radial fine lines around the lips, which are uh, commonly discussed with my patients and concerns about those. It can be used in fine lines really anywhere on the face, and it's also been indicated for lip enhancement in general. So using it along the lip border is a good uh, option for small and subtle enhancements. And I really think that's the key thing with these new products. We have to get away from what I call the poke and plump technique. I'm seeing way too many patients with overfilled cheeks and ballooned out lips that really do not make the lips look more youthful. They make it look ridiculous in my mind. And there's something that, um, that there's a lot of things that we can do to make people look better without making them look like they've had interventions. Restyl and Silk offers us a great opportunity to do that with fine lines. It's again a small molecule, tiny particle size, and you'll be hearing a lot more about Restyl and Silk in the near future. Restyl and Silk is delivered as a syringe, a 1 ml syringe, uh, tiny little injections and a very small needle. So please look forward to uh, research we're doing with it now. We are offering it as a clinically available product and uh, we're excited to, to see the future of this and a number of other new injectable filler products uh, as we go forward. Uh, if you have any questions about Restyl and Silk, please don't hesitate to write me at drmoss.com. You can send photographs if you want of uh, whatever your indication or concern is, and I'm happy to provide you some answers or even do some video imaging of you to show you what the before and after could look like. This is Dr. Corey Moss, as always, on Looking Your Best.